Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am Mystical Mermaid. Most folks call me M&M. &M. I'm sorry it took a minute. I was lighting that incense there. For some reason, it's just not going to light. If you are new, hey, howdy. Thank you for being here. Please subscribe. Y'all, if you're returning, you know, I love you guys. All right, everybody, whether you love me or you hate me, hit the thumbs up or down. Either way, okay? Please, it won't take me just a flipping second. All right, y'all. Let's get the overall energy for the collective watching my YouTube channel today on Friday, January 7th. Overall energy. Okay, we're going to talk about these in a moment. Y'all, I made a deck of cards. Imagine that. Eminem doing that. But I'm actually laminate them. They're so cute. But anyway, we'll talk about that later on my lives. But listen. All right. Someone's being rude. Someone's not being cute. Someone is, has had it. Someone has had it. Okay. Um, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to lie to you. I feel like this has been going on for, um, let me get one of these. All right. So let me give an example of what I'm, oh. Who's connecting? You? I bet it's you. Anyway. Um, listen. Have you ever... My family were loud. Really loud. Okay? Oh, speaking of which, let me get a little closer. Ah! Don't move my light! Okay, anyway. Um, it's like we have to scream over each other to be heard. Right? Have you ever been in, in a room that you have to do that? And it just, that's, you know, you got to love them from a distance because you can't go around them. And you just, it's like I, I, everybody's just screaming over top of everybody. And then your heart's beating out your chest. And that's what it's doing to me right now. And I'm getting nervous. And it's just real loud. Um, I feel like that's what this mood, like, I, I feel like doing that. Like, I, it, it's like. I don't know. It's almost as if um, or when you're in a fuss with somebody and you're trying to prove your point. There we go. And it's like the louder you get it's probably just I don't know. Some people are just like that. But it doesn't matter how loud you get or how rude you get. There's, you're going to be heard the same. Do you get what I'm saying? Um, it's like the more mean and loud you get, you just, I, I don't know. We've got strange companions in strange places. Challenges. Use your imagination. A loyal guardian. A magical protection is there for you and then the butterfly i am reborn okay someone is oh my god y'all it's like someone is afraid to transcend or to 
to uh, do something that they want to do, but <sighs> y'all's got some messed up energy today. I'm just going to move on to tarot and pray that God sends me the right words and right and the right wisdom to share with you. Okay, I just I need a minute with that. I need a minute with that. Okay, these ones then. All right, this is for the collective. On January 7th. What do they need to focus on today? In their life. About themselves. What do they need to focus on? Breathe. Just breathe. Queen of Pentacles. Very stable energy. Very um, motherly. Okay. Something's distracting you. You're faking it. You're faking a smile. You're faking it till you make it. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's like. The family. Maybe cleaning. Maybe spending time. Maybe you're snowed in like me. And you're just spending some time making some soup or some chili like me. And but something has you distracted. You need to be present. Be present. Um, or either poop or get off the pot. There's something. Okay. All right. All right. Male or female, whoever I'm talking to, there's someone that needs to put more focus on them and what it is that they want to do, but they've got other things that they have to do, okay? There's not enough hours in the day for this person that I'm talking to right now. Um, it's like you keep procrastinating what it is you want to do because you, you're doing everything else for everybody else. Stand your ground. But don't be rude. Because this is what's fixing to happen. You're fixing to be rude. You're fixing to be rude as hell. And this is like your warning. This is like your... Okay, breathe. Put your foot down. Communicate this out. Talk to everyone. Do some teamwork. Okay? Teamwork makes the dream work. So you... Can focus in on what it is that you're needing to do whether it be learning a new language or learning tarot or learning um how to crochet it wouldn't matter it's what you are wanting to do it's your desire you are manifesting this but look it's like you can't do it because you've got everything else going on for everybody else. And you can't choose you. Until. Oh, I'm, I'm on it. I, oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Y'all. Listen, I know I sound like a crazy lady most days. But listen, I'm telling you. If this is resonating right now, and I know it's resonating with somebody. I feel it, okay? If you don't choose you, and if you don't slow down and take some time for you and breathe, you're fixing to get angry and say some things that you don't mean, whether it be to your kids, to your family, to your mom, to your dad, papa, mama, cousins, aunts, whatever y'all call them, my aunt. Anyway, um, but you're fixing. Look at her. She's like pissed okay you're about you know how we take it and we take it and we take it until we blow up 
Right? Then I know I'm bad for that. I know I am. Okay. So give them some advice. Give them advice. What do we need to know? Lisa, I, I see that. I see that, okay? Give me a minute. <sighs> Wounded warrior here. Stand your ground. What did I say? God, when I know it, I know it. I'm on fire. Anyway, stand your ground, okay? You may have to put... Hey, put that... Hold on a second. Okay, sorry. All right. So, I don't care if you have to put your tool belt on, your uh, shield, your... I mean, I'd rather you not use weapons, okay? Because, honestly, the biggest weapon we'll ever truly carry, especially towards our family, and sharpest, is our tongue, okay? But look on the bottom here. Look at this, you guys. Queen of Swords. Holy moly. But listen, it has the potential to be what? Okay? A Queen of Swords... Whether it's upright, reverse, whatever. She's opinionated. She's a survivor. She's a tough little cookie. And it won't take much for her to cut you. If she feels like she's having to defend her or her honor, she will cut you. And not feel bad about it until after it's done. So... The seeds of this have already been planted, folks, because you're on thin ground right now. You're, you're fixing to lose it. If you do not stand up for yourself or you do not do what it is that you are desiring to do, that you have been called to do, I don't give a snot if it is crocheting. It's something that you're desiring. So take that time out. Maybe that's your time with God. Maybe that's your time to sit and reflect on your life and be show gratitude. Okay. Anything else I need to know about this? Basically everything I just said. Literally. Oh my see? The hermit, right there it is. You see what I'm saying? Look how happy. Okay? So, what are you waiting for, you know? You need to talk to someone. Tell someone. Okay? Because being rude doesn't mean you're going to be heard. Okay? Stand your ground. Alright. Let me pull your earth oracle here. Their high good. What do they need to hear before it turns WWE in their household? For their high good, what do they need to hear? Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, I'm gonna read these to you. Okay, now I'm not gonna read them all. We have the abundance to come out. We have you are sacred. Okay. Love yourself. And then we have river woman. Number 23. I don't actually think we've ever read that together. 23. River woman walking down the street. River woman. So if you really like pretty woman, then I'm talking to you. All right, river woman. A river woman is in touch with the shifts current. Oh, wait a minute, the shifting current of her soul. She embraces life as it comes. The gentle flow, the dammed up, the blockages, the rapids. How can we how can she stay calm among such change? She knows every situation 
no matter how challenging it may be. It is in favor of her highest good. Every fear is an opportunity for her to rise. Every obstacle is a chance for her to grow. And every blessing is a cause for celebration. She can flow through life like the wisdom of the earth's ancient rivers, dancing and sparkling, securing the knowledge that she will find calm waters again. When River Woman turns into your reading, she reminds you to trust in the journey mapped out for you. You may feel trapped in rapids right now or hitting rock bottom. Every turn is turbulence, or maybe you're at a fork trying to decide which way to go. Trust that the universe knows your intentions. You are on course to teach or to reach, I'm sorry, to reach your desires. You're exactly where you need to be. While your sight is limited to the stretch of water before you, the universe sees the entire river from the mouth to the tributaries and forks all the way to the sea. Now is the time to have faith and gather strength for the journey ahead. Fill in this time with journaling, gentle exercises, meditation, or creating for the sake of creation. Okay, so basically, yeah. Or it could have added crocheting on there. I'm just saying. I should have done that. i got to turn this heat on my legs. Oh, Lord of mercy. Y'all. Um, you see, I know I'm on point. I know there's someone struggling to have some me time. I don't care. Promise me that if this is a hashtag resonate, that you will take five minutes at least today for you. I don't care if you have to go lock yourself in a closet or in the bathroom like I do. Five minutes. That's all. Grab your Bible if you can. Go read a couple verses. You don't have to read chapters after chapters. Just open it to what God gives you. Okay? Y'all, I love you and I appreciate you. We've got to start taking care of ourselves. We have to. Not only because we'll fall apart if we don't. But spiritually, if we don't, then we're going to get burnt out. We're going to get tired. And we're not going to be as good as we once was. I, myself, would hate to know that I could have prevented. If I woke up and just was ordinary, I'd have no purpose, you guys. None. And it scares the shit out of me. I would hate to know I could have prevented that if I'd have took that five minutes. You know, what God gives us, he could take away. Y'all, I love you. Have an awesome day full of blessings. If you've got snow, be careful. If you get out, pray for me that I don't break my neck if I go out here with jacks. Y'all, love one another. Be kind to one another. I'll see you after a while. Bye.